tell me uh, how you kind of took the role on and kind of how you became this character. Um, it was a whole process. It was trying to figure out who this guy was. Uh, started watching a lot of uh, Snake Salvation and Moonshiners and looking guys up that lived in the Everglades and stuff. And, and that my character was described as a romantic sociopath who was good with a knife. So I figured uh, we, g we give him a scar and stuff. This is all fake. I just came from work, so but it, there's a big scar that goes down his face, and he, he chews tobacco, so he's got a big mouthful of tobacco all the time. And he's just dirty. I think my nails are still dirty from work, but uh, just dirty. And um, it's it's a role I've been really really excited about because for the last eight years I've played this you know nerdy guy on CSI, CSI New York, and to to get to play such a dark character and to to be such a badass. I just wanted to, it's, I mean, it's been so much fun to get to kind of work and, um, and I was such a fan of the show before, especially of, 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 of uh, Damon and the Dewey character and then find out I was going to be his, his, uh, his cousin and plus Rappaport and stuff. And, and it's like the crazy thing, man, is us, our family, they, we look alike. Like we're all kind of gingers in it. You know, I got the ginger beard, Rap's a ginger, Alicia's a ginger, he's a little ginger, so you do not mess with gingers. Don't mess with the gingers. Do you think the crows are all bad, or do they have redeeming qualities? It depends who you ask. We don't think we're bad. We believe in what we do. So we've conviction, and it's all what side of the coin you're looking at. So uh, we believe that we're doing something right, and, you know, we, and we're going to get what's ours, and... Uh, and I think that's for that when they believe in that it's right is is more scary because there's no there's no uh, conscious of I shouldn't have done that. So, but yeah, it's good. Is there anybody in the cast you have not had scenes with yet that you are dying to work with? Uh wow, who have I not? I think I've had scenes with everybody so far. I think so. Yeah, I had we had some great scenes with Boyd just recently. And that was he's he's a great guy working. See, I mean everybody. It just I, I I I geeked out when I got this role, man, and I'm I'm so pumped. It's been a blast so far to work. And I like I'm just I you know even coming up today, I'm like, man, FX. I'm on FX. This is cool. This is a badass network, and I'm not just saying that. Like I'm geeking out. This is cool. Any, any of the episodes you're particularly excited for fans to see? Uh. The, the crow, you really start to get to know about the crows in like the, the fourth episode. We re, you really kind of the dynamic because we, we we make the move and and uh, so it's in around the fourth episode you really start to understand who we are and we're we're messed up, man. We're a really dark, dysfunctional, loving family. Are you like your brothers or are you the opposite of your brothers? Um, that's a really good question. I am and I'm not. You know, I don't, I don't want to follow in their footsteps because I kind of see where they're going. But then again, I kind of have to. You know, they are my brothers. I have to do it. It's, you know, so I don't, I don't really know. It's a tough question. We'll have to see how it plays out. Wait, which brother do you kind of connect with more? Uh, I think Danny, Danny Crow. I think he's the one that I'm, I connect with the most. That's, you know, me and him. He always gives me a hard time. We're kind of like that big brother, little brother type deal going. You know. So, I think I think Danny. Was there anything when you read the scripts that you were just like, I can't believe I get to do this? Um, no, but they've added a few things in that I can't believe I've been able to do. I can't tell you. You got to watch it. It's going to be great. But uh, we shot a really fun scene today. I think everybody's going to like it. All right. And now, have you been shooting scenes with Tim Oliphant and Walton Goggins? Some of those guys. Um, I shot a couple with uh, with Tim and Jacob Pitts. Uh, a lot of fun. They're really fun guys to work with. Really funny. Uh, you know, if you mess up, that's I think that's my favorite part about working on the show. If you mess up, they're like, oh, it's all right. Let's do it again. You know, so that's a lot of fun. Okay, now the the brothers seem to wear just kind of t-shirt, jeans, nothing too much. What do you? What's your outfit like in the show? They're hand-me-downs. Yeah. Yeah. 